Yo, yo, it's your boy Ray Ray, keeping it ridiculous and real. It's my lunchtime, and I, I just heard something from Bill O'Brien and others that I was going to wait to make a video week four about it, um, but I can't, I, I can't, I, I can't wait. Um, it is unbelievable that a head coach would not know his players. And I'm talking about Duke Edgeford. Someone in the press conference this morning asked Bill about Duke Edgeford, and his first one was Edgeford. Is that who you're talking about? Oh, yeah, well, you know, he did pretty good with his pass rush. I think we should play him more. What do you mean? What do you mean, think? Bill, what are you what are you talking about? What do you mean you think? You should be able just to go to Rack and say, yeah, I want to go ahead and get him some more playing time with more than 12 snaps a game. You should be able to do that. And I'm starting to be convinced, and, and, and I, I've, I've been fighting this and fighting this and fighting this, but I actually am gonna have to come around and say it. Bill O'Brien has coordinators and coaches that are under him that will not challenge him. Me, and I don't mean challenge his position. I mean, tell him, hey, this is what I see, coach. You know, you're running this, and, you know, if I'm Sean Payton, I'm, I'm asking questions. Like, why can't we run this versus that? Why would we run two wide receiver screens in a row? Because you didn't think they would catch on to that? I, I mean... Like, I honestly think that the reason we don't get good coordinators here that are under Bill is because Bill would feel threatened. Bill would feel threatened. I don't know if people are going to say, well, what about Romeo Cornell? Romeo Cornell can give two shits or a hell of what's going on with Bill O'Brien. Romeo Cornell is not the head coach anyways. And Romeo Cornell has been around long enough to where if Bill O'Brien as the head coach said, hey, I want I want to do this more. He would do that, and he would find a way to make it work. Rack is a professional. I don't think he would, but he, but he is a yes sir. Think about it. I just, I mean, if Romeo Cornell, with all this experience he has, is still saying yes sir to Bill O'Brien, that should give you an idea of everything that's going on in the front office. One of the biggest concerns about Brian Game coming here was him and Bill, buddy buddy, known each other. They're gonna get prospects that probably aren't worth the shit and you know at this point even though it's early it's early but at this point there's a little bit of validity to it look at what's going on i'm sorry man i had to make a little rant about this i just i was at lunch and i heard that and my brain instantly went to what are you kidding me that they, what do you mean maybe he should you're the coach, dude. You're the head coach of this team. Take ownership. Take leadership. You always talk about accountability. How about holding yourself to that same accountability, man? I'm sorry. I just I couldn't deal with the frustration of it. I'm just, oh, my God. How can someone be a head coach of a franchise and have no damn idea what's going on? Because that's how it feels right now. That's how it seems. I don't know, man. That's what I got. Anyways, as per usual, we can agree to disagree. But <coughs> leave your comment. Let me know what you're thinking. Like, sub, and peace.